hello guys welcome back again i'm mj in this video i'll show you how to fix wi-fi does not have valid ip configuration error maybe because of this error you are not getting the wi-fi or internet so i will show you four or five steps to watch this video carefully before i start my video i have only one request 99 percent of you did not subscribe to my channel if you got any help from video then please subscribe so first thing when you get this problem directly unplug your router okay directly unplug your router and wait for one minute or two minutes and then plug it on and then try to reconnect your wi-fi this is a basic method okay try it first and after this if this not work then go to setting and here type date and time open the date and time and your date and time must be correct as per your country and region okay so set the correct date and time because of wrong date and time it will create the wi-fi issue or internet issue so set the correct date and time if it's not work then go to start and here type cmd right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator and here type this simple codes so i have given this code in my video description link so first type this code ip config space slash flash dns and hit enter and after this type this net sh space winsock space reset and hit enter after this close the command prompt and reboot your pc okay after reboot your pc try to use your internet if it's not work then do one thing right click on network or property click on change adapter setting right click on your wi-fi or ethernet and click on property and here select the internet protocol version 4 select it and click on property and select the use the following dns server address okay select it and here type 8888 and in the alternate server type 8844 and click ok ok and close it now try to reconnect your wi-fi okay if it's not work then go to the services open the services and here find wlan auto config open it and this should be automatic okay and the status should be running if it is stop or not running then select the automatic and then click on start then click apply and okay yeah and try to use the wi-fi if it's not working then do one thing all right click on this pc click on manage select the device manager and here extend the network adopter so select the your network adopter so mine is uh, this one wireless lan right click on it and click on update driver and here click browse my computer for driver and then click on let me pick up from my list so here select the best available driver for your wi-fi or ethernet and then click next and after this you need to reboot your pc okay click next and follow the on screen instruction to complete the installation and after this reboot your pc and then try to use your internet if it's not work then do one thing go to setting and then network and internet scroll down and click on advanced network setting and here click on network reset okay this will completely reset your network so after this you need to retype your password and you need to reconfigure your wi-fi okay so just click on re reset now and then after reset reboot your pc and then reconfigure your wi-fi and try to use it so i have showed five or six methods let me know in comments which option or which method fix your issue so thank you for watching guys catch you next time please like share and subscribe thank you very much guys